before I get in the video, I just want to let you guys know I recorded like gameplay and stuff. I spent like 30 minutes recording gameplay with the skin and everything. And unfortunately, it bugged out and there's no game audio. So we're not going to show a lot of it. I'm just going to show a couple snippets so you guys can see all the new stuff, including the skin that's on my screen, which you can't see yet. But it'll have my voice and it'll have the gameplay and all that. But again, there is no audio. So I won't show you the entire thing as it's not fun to watch without audio. But with that being said, let's go ahead and roll the video. Brand new update is out. We got a new skin. Uh, I don't know exactly what's new other than this right here. It looks like we have headgear. Wait, headgear, fire break, backpack, and clothes. Okay, so I guess there's a fire break. Is this like a... Wait, so this is separate? I'm confused. Is this like a, a BR thing? Details. You get the fire break operator or skin or whatever, and it looks like you can also get other stuff with it that like you can customize them with. Okay, so I guess this is a customizable skin uh, where you can add different pieces on. So they're not selling it all in one piece, which I know is going to piss off a lot of people. Um, but what is kind of cool, as far as I know, is that since this is a lucky draw, the chances of getting something related to the Firebreak skin is really high. And that's because there is, what, uh, 10 items and three of them are related to Firebreak. Uh, we also have a new emote as well, Point. It's pretty cool. And then the rest of it is just some pretty standard skins, including the uh, the 1001 Knights, which is a really cool skin series. And then also a Gridiron Type 25, the Nade, and then a uh, Tank skin. Oh, this is actually really cool. This is epic too. So we have a HSO 405 skin. Um, it looks like you're able to take a little bit more damage when sliding. So that's the standard shoddy epic perk. Uh, but yeah, so let's just go right into this and see exactly how much it costs to get everything. Uh, and then we'll look at the rest of the update. I don't know if there's more stuff or it's just this, uh, but we'll definitely check as soon as we get this skin. I want to see if there's a new weapon skin as well, or if the um, fire break is the only one. All right, so see, <laughs> what do we spend like 80 and we already got the headset? So that's actually really good. So it seems like you have to have the fire break character. Uh, you have to get the bundle. That's what it seems like, which will be the skin as well as the actual fire break character. Anyway, let's go ahead and open it up. Get 200. It is pretty cool though that we can like customize characters a little bit more. So in the future, we should be getting like things that you can add on skins that you already have, which is pretty cool. So if you have a favorite skin, you don't really want to use a different one. You'll be able to just like tweak it up. Um, by the way, I'll have a running total on the screen of how much I've spent so far. I don't know for sure. It should be right around like 680, maybe. I don't know. Uh, it should be on the screen exactly how much I've spent so far though. But right there, we get the PDW skin. Go ahead and spend 700. And more than likely gonna get like the, okay. We're gonna get the nade skin right there. Go ahead and go again, spend 1200. And we're gonna get the emote, pretty cool. Uh, and now I actually have to go get more CP, so I'll go ahead and do that real quick. Okay, so now we have 12,440, so we're gonna go ahead and spend more. Uh, getting pretty close to having the entire thing. This will give us the LK skin, cool. And then let's open up another one. And we're gonna get, probably the backpack? Oh no, the HSO, okay. So here's that skin. I actually really like how this looks. Dude, I'm gonna delete you, I swear. All right, there we go, HS0405, pretty sick. Go ahead and continue, and then spend 3,500. This will give me the backpack more than likely. I highly doubt we'd actually get the firebreak skin. Yeah, okay, so our last thing we're gonna get is the firebreak skin, so that's the backpack. And then we're still, a we're 60 CP short. That's kind of crazy, actually. Okay, so now we can finally get the final one. So this was actually really expensive. I think the past lucky draws have been cheaper. I could be wrong. I'll show you guys exactly how much I spent through this entire thing on your screen right now. Uh, but let's go ahead and actually look at the skin and exactly how it works, basically. Oh! Oh, so it gives you a bundle and you have to open it. Okay. Man, I was confused. So you have to go to your inventory and then you have to actually like accept it or open it, I guess. It gives you like a bundle and you have to get the pieces. Okay, I was gonna say, dude, that's super confusing. So let's just go ahead and open up all this stuff. Okay, so now we actually opened it all, which was a really weird way of doing things. So that's completely new. So let's go ahead and actually throw it on and see what it looks like. All right, so there it is, Firebreak Carrot Thief. This is like the basic one with the headgear, which we can put on, the backpack, which we can put on. Uh, which is that and then the clothing which is this so this is without the clothing this is with Go and put it on and then there's no suit that we can do so that's like the full skin so you could go really bright and colorful and all that if you want to or you could just go with the default fire break 
and I'm sure maybe in the future we'll get other stuff as well like skins with customizations uh, that's the thing that's most exciting is how we'll be able to it, it's kind of showing us something new that could be utilized a little bit more in the future and hopefully with some more cheaper options because obviously the lucky draw option is the most expensive and I literally had to spend all the money and get the entire thing to even use this stuff because they only work on the firebreak skin so obviously that's not the the best way of doing things because it's super super expensive to get this guy so hopefully in the future we'll get some cheaper stuff as well but this is what it looks like and let's go ahead and put on like maybe the lk skin i guess all right so this is the lk skin let me go ahead and just kind of we'll leave the iron sights just normal and then i'll put some attachments on it all right so that's what it looks like with the skin and then also let's do another class with with the HSO 405, let me go ahead and equip it and upgrade it. Go ahead and put on a laser sight, a long barrel, and a fast reload. And then we'll rock this one with just the default fire break. As you can tell, it matches actually super well. I wonder if they did that on purpose. So yeah, we have that version, and then we have um, this version. So as you can tell, that's the difference. So let's just go ahead and load into a pub free-for-all to kind of get a look at what the, uh, the skin and the guns look like. Bro, this thing is crazy. This is actually one of the coolest looking skins in my opinion. I don't know. I don't like the gun, so I won't use it a lot, but this this skin looks sick. I have to admit. Something about the top being flat just looks really dope. We'll go ahead and check out what the iron sights look like as well. That's the iron sights. I think that's kind of normal. I uh, never use this gun, so I don't really know. Oh wait, it's not team. I thought it was team based. What the? What the? Dude, this gun is terrible. I haven't tested this gun. I did a guide on the BY50. Ah! I don't have the range on it. Oh, I don't have my um, little crosshair. No! Bro, this thing is god awful. It's so slow. And it doesn't seem like it. Okay, there we go. Eh. Not a great shotgun player, so don't judge. See, that's just one tap. That one tap. Just come through. Bro, come on. The range on it. Okay, we're actually doing decent now. Get a quick reload. Let me shoot. Oh my god. Dude, it doesn't have any range compared to like the BY-15. And I have a long barrel too. There we go. Oh, that was kind of clean, not gonna lie. No, we got wall banged. Yo, we're actually kind of catching up. We gotta get this dub. Real Hawks. I played three games now and all. Oh, come on, no way. Okay, there we go. That was kind of clean. Got hit marker. No, the guy stole it. No, dude, I have no range with this thing. What? Oh, okay, I was about to say the lag. Give me one. Uh, no way. No, there's a guy right there. I have no range. Pulling it off. Okay, that was short. No. Oh, I got that guy. No way. Did you run through? That didn't hit. Dude. I hate this gun. It looks so sick. If they give it to the BY-15, that'd be dope. Or a KRM version even. Oh, there we go. Oh, barely. Got him. It is fun to use. It doesn't even reach that far. Imagine not having enough range on Nuketown. Couldn't be me. Let me shoot. This guy with the type is especially... Oh, that was weird. This guy right here. That didn't connect? No, I lost. Okay. Well, that's what that looks like. So now let's go ahead and do a BR real quick and just hear like the audio file and kind of look at what the character looks like. But damn, dude. Damn. All right, so that's what that looks like. Definitely a cool looking setup. I'll say that much. Uh, so now let's go into Battle Royale loadout and make a loadout all right so here's what the character looks like i do have 30 fps on this device so kind of bad uh this is what he sounds like what does he not say anything um i don't know i really never pay attention to the audio but it's, he's not saying anything should he be saying something does he just not have an audio file i thought he'd say stuff i haven't heard this guy say a single word so far so again i don't really play br so i don't know if he's supposed to be saying stuff right now i thought he would uh anyway here's what the character looks like um, it's kind of hard to show it off because this is mostly a first person game so you can't really see what you look like apart from like your gloves and stuff so the idea of the video is mainly just to get the skin show you how to collect it because obviously I had issues with that as well as the gun skins 
But with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to drop a like and a sub if you did. I also made a video going over how much money I've actually made from my million view videos on my second channel. So if you guys are interested in something like that, make sure to check the link down below. And once again, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Peace.